I'm Trey, and this is lesson number two, or sort of lesson number one and a half, because I gave you some stuff, uh, like your first lesson to learn on the last video, and what I'm doing on this one is I'm sort of showing you how to apply it. Highway to Hell's pretty basic song, pretty much anything by ACDC. Guy's a good drummer, but he plays what the music requires and makes it sound good and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a video that I, I played over the weekend at an outdoor party and I put a drum cam behind me so that I could record the stuff I was doing to see how it looked and I figured it would be a good idea to put that on the video just showing you the basic beat that I taught you and how to apply it. Uh, that was kind of my downfall with playing guitar was they tried to teach me Mary Had a Little Lamb and I wanted to learn how to play Kiss. So this is going to be uh, ACDC and I'm going to chop this part of it off and play the video and then I'm going to go back and show you the things that are in the song that I didn't really cover in the first video but they're pretty basic drum parts. So. This will be the drum video of me playing it live, and then I'll go over the things that I didn't show you that are just, if you watch the first video and you've got that down, you should be able to pick up
where are you going? some variations to it but check it out and you'll see it's pretty much the same beat So you kind of get the picture. The only difference is between the beat. Cracking your hi-hats open a little bit like you're using them as a crash symbol. And the build up. And I like to put a bass drum in there on one. Spin. I'm kind of slack on that. I don't do the around the fingers thing, which looks pretty cool. I taught myself to do that one, and from a distance, I'd say this one looks better. So, if you're working on your stick spins while you're doing this, I mean, a lot of people. that when they're learning just so that by the time you get to where you can play you've already got a couple of tricks up your sleeve and they feel comfortable you know so that's something you can do when you're sitting on the sofa and you're learning to play drums just sit there and drop sticks while you're trying to spin them around your middle finger like I do it like that Oops. 
a lot of people just put them between these two fingers and do it that way or with this hand either way forward backward around your fingers but just something to get you in there doing something showy and I started playing kind of a jazzy style when I was playing before Tommy Lee came out and was so that's something you might want to think about working on your style too now that you can play a beat take that beat and start working on your style as a player how you're gonna look when you play Just put your drums in front of the mirror and be like, how do I want to look like if you got a drummer that you really like there are a lot of good ones out there and you kind of model yourself after their playing style think about that anyway um, I'll have something for another lesson soon. I'll take it to the next level. I just figured I'd put this out there so you know how to apply your beat. Yeah, you didn't get the... But you did get a song to work on. Hopefully that's cool and you enjoy it and I'll get working on another lesson.